Heading into the Oahe backcountry, you won't find much. It's a desolate landscape, but a perfect place to hunt chuckers, a bird native to India and the Middle East. In the chuckers case, um, they were brought uh, kind of late 1800s, early 1900s, and they occupy this uh, arid uh, rangeland of the West primarily. Hunting this bird takes a team effort. Kevin Gray has two German wired hair pointers named Wally and Ringo. What are you smelling, buddy? Oh yeah, this is probably the one of the best dogs you can get for chucker. And you get, they're uh, from a local breeder in Napa. They could be right over this hill. The dogs use their sense of smell to track chuckers. Well, when they get real low and start wiggling their butt like that, that's when you know they're around. But shooting these birds after they flush can be frustrating. <sighs> oh yeah, yeah, it's challenging. They're definitely one of the fastest game birds in the US. Plus, chasing chuckers over rocky terrain, up and down the hills, on uneven ground, on their turf, it's exhausting. Uh, without a doubt, I mean, most uh, chucker hunters who go out uh, do it for the challenge. And yeah, the saying you're referring to is the first time you go hunt, chucker hunting is for, for fun. Every time after that is for revenge because it's just extremely challenging, especially when you hunt in places like Hell's Canyon, uh, the Owyhees, and some of the other rugged terrain in, in uh, southern Idaho. Eat this. But on the off chance of connecting, with perfect sights in one flush makes all the trouble worth it for Kevin Gray. I might get one out of every flush, but uh, I was, you know, got lucky and ended up getting three out of three shots, which is pretty rare, but, you know, pretty exciting at the same time. Time to ring the dinner bell. It's a pretty good tasting bird. Steve Dent, six on your side.